today we're going to walk into the Cartier store uh, just before the price increase. So this is Francis, hey. our favorite essay here at Highland Park. Uh, if you guys are looking for an amazing essay, this is him. Um, oh, thank he you works. So what days do you work, Francis? I work Sundays, <laughs> Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Okay, guys. So come and see him. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Anytime. I'm here for y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Which one should she get? I'm conflicted between getting one with the diamond. You know, it's funny. I've been working at Cartier for 15 years. Uh -huh. And not once have I ever had somebody come that got the diamond and said, I want, I don't want the diamond. <laughs> I, do, I do regret this one. You regret yeah. getting the diamonds on yeah. that one? Yeah. I, every single person <laughs> I've had always, that gets the non-diamonds always said, why well, didn't I, I get the diamond? Maybe Actually, it's too tight. <laughs> oh, yeah, the size. It's the are you kidding? Francis, what do you think? I, I always know. love the diamonds. You know, I always say even more than the 10 then diamonds. I'll, then like, I would rather just get uh, silver. My the reason why we like the um, silver gold is because white gold. The white gold, yeah. It's because it has rhodium plating. Yeah, whenever it has the diamonds, it has. The, when it doesn't have the diamonds, it doesn't have the rhodium plating, so, so it looks it, more of a grayish gold. And then it looks metal looking, right? It Over would time. like, uh, in a way, kind of, but yeah. Then couldn't you just uh, add the white gold back on? We we unfortunately like if it didn't come with rhodium plating, Cartier won't uh, oh, put it right I there. Did yeah. Not know. So like, if it has the diamonds, it came with rhodium plating. It has to have rhodium plating. Uh, He's so gonna see how much it's gonna go up so next far. week. Six zero four seven seven uh, one seven and oh, I forgot about that. Right there. Yeah, good <laughs> so uh, price. So yeah, it's actually going up uh, like uh, four hundred dollars. Wow. Uh, okay, I guess I have to buy it. So this one's going up twenty five hundred. Yeah. The pave. Oh my goodness, that's so nice. I don't even know how much this one's going up with this one. About 5000 I would say so. I can double check with this one. 42000 Oh my goodness. And but you know why I like it? It doesn't scratch. Yeah, you don't notice the scratches as much. Like with yeah. the diamond. They make one in white gold That's with diamonds in the in the circles right here. And those are like, that one's like 58. Someone's going to cut my arm off. <laughs> no. Oh my God, it's nice. <laughs> That's what my husband keeps saying. Three hundred and seventy-two thousand dollars. Three hundred thousand. Oh, oh. Celebrity spider. Huh? You'd be amazed. Oh my god, people are just like that. That like one. It all depends on the person. Like somebody that has like everything, they're like, might as well <laughs> just get something out. Just un clue. Just a nail in French. <laughs> Any preference or which? So Let's start with the rose. rose. Yeah. yeah. I like rose. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
โอ้ขานใช่ขานใช่ not getting my money's worth to the bigger thicker version okay you fit that one okay try it in the middle finger it won't fit honey I'm not trying to get lotion on it in the love ring if you ever need to make it smaller we can make it smaller by putting gold in the inside and just make it like one size smaller but if you ever need to make it bigger there's nothing we can do yeah like this is too small for me right no. <laughs> say cartier you say cartier 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 yeah. okay, there we go guys that's how you say that's it like Welcome back Hi to guys. Twin with the V. So today we'd like to talk to you guys about our recent trip to the Cartier store. Oh, better. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. Um, he taught me. But uh, we wanted to make our purchase before the price increase before June 30th. Yes, right? yes. So, like... I'm on b a n a l i n g right now, but I'm like, yeah, she doesn't want to buy anything, and I kind of persuaded her. I'm like, I just, I don't need anything. I don't need anything, but I'm like, do I later on do I want to pay that extra? Was it four hundred dollars? Yes. So I'm like, no, I don't. So I just it's like tax money. Yeah. So I just bit the bullet, and um, you know, our trip was like it was it was fun. I like really yeah, fun. and we love Francis. So if you guys are um around Dallas and you're in the Highland area, Highland Park. Um, as for Francis, I mean, I actually met him through the phone. Yeah. So I actually, because um, during COVID, um, we were only able to set appointments, and so I called the Cartier store, and I I was like, "Is there any appointments available?" And he was actually on the phone, and he got me in, and from then on, I. Well, actually, just, he said no. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah she oh, said. Yeah. She I'm said. Like, okay, yeah. I'm like, if you can't get me in, then I'm just gonna buy it from online. Online. And like, he's like, no, no, I'll s e n d you in. Oh yeah, I forgot about that part. Like, Thanks, Francis, if you're watching this, <laughs> But he he apologized. He was like, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> But I mean, um, after that, I kept his contact, and um, our whole family uses him. Yeah. Really? The thing is that um, we love we love him because he responds back. Yeah, so a lot of yeah, a lot of that. My my first essay that I do text, I never get a response. I'm like, oh my gosh. No, but um, he but, was on a trip yeah. last week, and I texted him, hey, Francis, are you free? Are you available this week? Can you get me in? And even though he was on his trip, he was flying out. He still texted me and kept in touch, and he was like, hey, I can't get to the computer right now, but once I do, I'll let you know. But I mean, I like that, you know? Yeah. So let's unbox what we got, guys. Um, so you obviously, purchase. you get a bag, a shopping bag, and um, every time when you do purchase an item, you do get a cleaning kit. This Sometimes you do have to ask for it, but they most likely know to give you one. But whenever I first purchased mine, um, I did purchase three items, and she only gave me one cleaning kit. But a lot of the times when you do purchase, they give you one cleaning kit per item. So that's something that you should like. Kind of ask, ask for, for, I guess, but I did ask, and she said she ran out. But I think she's lying. <laughs> but anyways, but I really, I usually don't use this. I, I do use it, use it because for the diamonds it does help, but for like the regular gold, it does work too. Because then when you clean it on the white cloth, it does show a lot of black dirt. I use this thing on Amazon. It's like a cloth. And like it's amazing, guys. We're, oh I'm yeah, gonna, we'll link it down. I'll link it down below for you guys, just so you guys. That can one works too, but it does take out some metal, right? I see it. Yeah, it's cause there's yeah no, but you can tell there's a difference though. Yeah. And then obviously, um, travel pouch. I love it. I like this. I mean, she says she doesn't I never use, use it. it. I use it a lot, like but, to store other stuff. Yeah, in. why not get one? You know, it's free. <laughs> Plus, he also gave me some perfume. Oh, perfume! Yes. Oh, there was this one perfume sample right here. Oh. That one too. Oh. But guys, my aunt she got this um as a perfume set. It comes in three and it's tiny. It's like big. No, it's big bottle. In this. But it's free. She asked for it, the perfume mm -hmm. sampler, and she got it. I'll um attach a pic below. But asked for it, you know. Mm -hmm. I asked for. She didn't care for it though. But I asked Francis, does he have a book that I can take home? That is it. Yeah, I mean, he says you can come back. Yeah, I can come back and get one. But it's the book he gave. But me. I rather have the perfume sample. Yeah, now you and know, the good right? thing with Francis, he does hook you up with gifts, so <laughs> I would go to him because we yeah. all like goodies, right? Okay, so and he asked us, did we want to wrap it or we wanted to take it home? But I'm like, we want to do an unboxing. I, mean, I didn't really care. She and she's like, like, I don't really care, but I'm like, let's just do an <laughs> unboxing. Okay.
Okay, guys, <laughs> she copied yeah. me, okay, before we even start this. Okay. I wasn't expecting to buy this, to be honest. Um, She had to copy me, guys. Literally. Well, the only reason why I just went for this one is because I was going for a rose gold with no diamonds because it's cheaper, you know, by at least two thousand dollars. Yeah. But whenever I wore it on my wrist, it looked too blended in. Yeah. I needed contrast, and I wasn't gonna buy a regular white gold one because, like as he said, you cannot put rhodium plating on it once it's. Um, goes away, looks more metalish, metal it, was it? Metal. Grayish. Grayish. So I'm like, um, with the diamonds, um, it has that shiny thing, so whenever I have to go get it uh, done again, it will look exactly like this, besides the other kind where you can't do it. I like the thin one too, yeah. because it's easy to put on by yourself. Yes, versus the regular love where you have to screw both sides in. Um, I knew that when we were going to purchase for the price increase, I wanted a thin one for sure, just so it can have variety mm -hmm. on my wrist. But um, I was indifferent between the rose gold. I wanted rose gold. I didn't want the oh. yellow gold. But when I put it um, on, it looked this like it looked too blended in, and it just looked the same, you know. Yes. But I mean, I'm glad with this purchase. Yeah, I'm happy with it as well. But I, I mean, whenever I first brought my juke. I'm not really happy with this and I'll explain to you guys on our next video why I'm not happy with this purchase um like they say you can't ever go wrong with diamonds but for the price difference between the regular and with diamonds it's significant you know and, and you know yeah I mean to me I'm glad I didn't purchase the one with the diamonds but I mean that's my preference and she's gonna say it's because I didn't want to pay that extra money, but I really didn't see a big of a difference. So inside the box obviously comes with a screwdriver. Um, since this is white gold, it comes with the um, silver one. This one has six diamonds inside. Let's take it out and see. They do have one that comes with 10 diamonds, but for us, it just didn't seem like it was worth the money for all of the all through it comes with like besides the symbol it will come with diamond 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 but it, it got lost in it so i wouldn't pay for the 10 diamonds um, everyone is different but even the essay agreed with us that um he always tell his customers that the six diamond one is better than buying the 10. so in the beginning i was wearing my juke face facing up the nail part but because it says flush it didn't overlap that's why they tell you to get one size down from the love but now since i have size 17 love um if i wear it this way it does overlap so i have to wear it like this a lot of people wear it like this anyway but just to let you guys know that if you do it wear it this way the love bracelet will get damaged if I run my fingertips towards here I see a lot of indentions and on top of that my nail head is very flat surface the metal did um, kind of indented down so that's something that you have to be aware of but a lot of people do it wear it this way anyway it doesn't really bother me but I might just switch it back now because um, I don't want to get it any more damage so I'm gonna unbox my next so, you have one already, right? Yeah, I have one, but I don't really wear it that often. I do wear it, but um, not as much as I thought I would. But for her, she's trying to get a size that fits all of her fingers. <laughs> so I just got the um, regular love ring, the thin version. Mm -hmm. The thick one uh, looks too thick on her fingers. It doesn't look good. This one was only um, $1,150, but um, you purchased it and back in October for, I think, a thousand fifty. Yeah. So it went up a hundred dollars, and then now it's gonna go up again. So I mean, if you guys are wanting it, I would suggest just buying it. You know, because you're gonna. I I wear my rings every day. This is the juke, and I wanted it uh, to match. And I actually got this in rose gold. In rose gold and yellow gold, you can barely tell the difference. So I wanted these to match. I mean, to fit in each finger. But then you have to say that your juke is 
total different size than that one. Okay, so usually uh, my juke, this I bought, purchased in size 53, right? Usually when you buy 11, you go one size up, which would be a 54. This time, uh, the 54 was really tight on my fingers. Mm -hmm. So I he suggested I go up one more size, so I purchased the 55. Yeah, it's a 55. And I got rose gold just because I want it to be um, a little contrast. But whenever it does like fade when you keep wearing it, it does turn into kind of like yellow gold anyway. So this is how it looks like and you guys can see. We'll do a closer video. But I mean, you guys can't really tell, but I like it. And especially you want to add diamonds, like a thin band of diamonds. I think that'd yeah, be nice. Yeah, that will pop. But that'd be like a lot of like diamonds. Thing but look how cute it is! <laughs> I don't want to wear too many rings because it looks like brass knuckles. I mean, but I <laughs> cute. Girl. Between the two rings, um, the rose gold is just a little bit more pink than the yellow, but over time they'll look the same. Um, I like the thin ones better because you can stack them. This is a really good piece for stacking if you guys want to stack your rings and things like that. Um, the thick one, I wouldn't, I would just leave it alone, where, alone unless you have like really long fingers. So this is how I stack my love ring with the juke. Um, these are both the thin version. I like it because it's, um, it's more feminine to me. The love ring is in rose gold and then the juke is in the yellow gold. So you guys can tell there's a little contrast. But um, later on, I know for sure that the rose gold is going to turn to yellow. But I like it because um, you can kind of tell there's a difference in between the two colors. But um, yeah, that's what we purchased at the Cartier store. I mean, I suggest if you guys are wanting something, buy it. If it's within your means and you get, you're ready to purchase it, then I say go for it. Like me, like personally, like I think about it before I purchase a big item, right? But to me, I was like, I'm gonna buy it anyways. So I might as well purchase it before the price increase. And that way it makes me feel a little bit better, you know? Yeah. So you know we, we're always trying to save some type of money, but <laughs> since we don't know anyone in Oregon or Delaware, you yes. can say no tax. So I went online <laughs> and I just grabbed a, like a regular address yeah. that's on <laughs> Realtor.com and I just literally typed in an address and Oregon has no tax and Delaware has no tax. But Louisiana is 4, 4 point, point, around 4.5%. So I mean... Do your homework and maybe have someone that's family or relative that lives in Oregon or... Yeah, I would just ship it to their house and, and pick it up later or ask if you trust them. them Cause girl, that thing might be gone, <laughs> but you just don't know, right? For us, like um, we could ship as well, but we don't know that person well. And if... Too we yeah, yeah, And we can't blame them if it's gone. So I'm like, I'm not gonna take that risk because... To save $500. He does a lot of money to begin with. So I'm like... I would though if if I could, but no, because we could have bought it in Hawaii too. But oh, it wasn't to save three point five. Yeah, but it wasn't, and at that time, I didn't want to spend that much money. But because you know, when you're in the moment and like you're spending this amount already, and then you have to spend more, like it's, it's it too much. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah. And I really go to Francis, <laughs> so then he can help me with goodies. <laughs> but they also like um, scratch wise and. Things like that. It was yes. really bothersome in the beginning, but now we're so like used to it. Um, he did say that you can take out the scratches there at Cartier for free, but it's not like um, sending it to New York. It's right? like a deep cleaning. Yeah, deep cleaning. And he doesn't suggest that too often. But for me, uh, I, if it takes out some gold, I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to let it out. I would up. wait five years. I mean, let it mess up. I would five say five years? 10 years. No, five years. <sighs> Honestly, no, I wouldn't even do it at all. Right? Would you? I would. You would? I mean, it gets. I'm gonna wait so until I give it though. to my daughter. Like, how old are we gonna have this until? Yeah. How long? How long will you wear this until? Like, you're sixty? Probably. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. I mean, I plan to pass this down to my daughter. That's yes. why I rather buy it brand new. Um, that way we have the certificate and everything with it, along with it, and then like it's just like kind of memories. Like, mm -hmm. how I mean, I don't mind buying it used as well, but we don't know where to buy it from. Like on Fashion Fall, you only save like what two hundred dollars. No worries. So is that worth it? I mean, I would buy it if it was like ten percent off plus another ten percent off. Like you know, they have that those deals like on right. They have yeah, some yeah, type yeah, of yeah. deal like a lunar new yeah. year. They had ten percent off extra, and that's when I bought my. Uh, 
But girl, you gotta look at the date. Sometimes it's like from two thousand. No, this one's only two thousand and twenty. That's why I bought it. Okay, but yeah. you have to look at the dates, okay? Because some of them is like from two thousand eleven. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's like not worth it. Wait, that's like that's, that's too like ten old. years. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. I wouldn't. So okay. look at the dates when you guys purchase it. You know. So like, also don't forget that uh, oh, your yes. bracelets do come with a certificate in your rings. So, so it'll come like this. Make sure sometimes you never know. Like people make mistakes and um, read your serial. Serial like, numbers should be. The same. Correct. Yeah, as the as inside the engraving inside. Yes, your items. So we hope you guys found our video helpful today. Um, if you guys have any questions, comments, please leave them down below. We love to answer all of them. And our next video, we're gonna talk about um, cardio sizing, like gone wrong for me, <laughs> for her. Uh, it's it's a big mistake, and um, I want to explain to you guys why um, I picked the size I did in the beginning. So we'll go, we'll get to that video next. But thank you guys for watching. Bye.